Unfortunately, the opposition that Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez and other progressives face in regards to the Green New Deal doesn't just come from the right, doesn't just come from Republicans. Unfortunately, it comes from some Democrats, too. Democrats that should be Republicans, but, you know, we have two right-wing parties. Nancy Pelosi rams austerity provision into House Rules Package over objections of progressives. Despite pressure from progressive Democrats, the House Rules Package for the 116th Congress will include a pay-as-you-go provision requiring all new spending to be offset with either budget cuts or tax increases. So this is commonly referred to as PAYGO. We've talked about PAYGO on the show before, what PAYGO does if you pay for anything. This article comes from Joseph, by the way. If you pay for anything or if you want to implement any type of policy, you have to offset the cost right away. You can't just say, we're, hey, we're reallocating the resources. We're going to change the way healthcare is distributed in this country. It's going to not leave anybody behind and it's going to cost less than what we pay now to the private insurance industry. You can't do that. It has to be offset with costs within the governmental budget. So it would have to be offset with tax, uh, taxes or something like that. So what is this going to do? This is going to kneecap any chance at progressive policy changes. Why? Well, because that's the priority of the democratic establishment. Again, winning is priority number three. Priority number one, make the donors happy. Priority number two, Keep those progressives in check because that goes along with making those donors happy. Priority number three, maybe we'll beat a Republican or two. But if not, no biggie. Gravy train keeps rolling. Nancy Pelosi, who will be sworn in on Thursday, has promised to, for months to restore the Paygo rule. Why? Because I guess it's a bipartisan marketplace of ideas. She instituted this when first taking over the Speaker's Gavel in 2007. She ran into resistance from progressives who believed that the rule would make it more difficult for Democrats to pass a host of liberal agenda items from Medicare for all to a Green New Deal to tuition-free public college. You know those things that pretty much everybody wants. Critics also argue that PAYGO creates an unlevel playing field where Republicans can get to blow giant holes in the tax code while Democrats must pay fealty to the deficit. So... The group who is campaigning on building a wall, a useless, waste of resources, racist wall, they could spend the money. They could spend the money the way they feel like it. They can give all the tax cuts to their rich friends that they want. But the group that's supposed to be standing for Medicare for All, standing for a Green New Deal, standing for tuition-free college, they gotta, they got to find somewhere in the budget to cut something else. You see how it's rigged. You see how it's tilted to just favor the elite. And that's why this is a plutocracy. All right, let's see what else is in this article. All right, there's an enormous appetite in the Democratic Party and among all Americans for major public investment to tackle our nation's major crisis. And by the way, we're already spending the money. Medicare for all, again, would save money. Medicare for all would save money. Pelosi and the Democratic Party leadership support of PAYGO actually makes solving these crises all but impossible. The Democratic Party leadership is unilaterally disarming and shooting themselves in the foot. No, they're just making the donors happy. That's really what they're doing. They're making the donors happy. Uh, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez will be voting against this, as will Ro Khanna. As of the recording of this, this is news, uh, this is pretty much breaking today. As of the recording of this, I don't know any other individuals that are standing against it, uh, but I do know of those two that have said outright they are standing against it. Pay go. Get your news on with Rhonda, do you want to know what's going on? We're getting our news on today. Get your news on with Ron, don't you wanna know what's going on? We're getting our news on today, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can tweet me an article at Ron Placone. We'll go through it together 